Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. Today we are back on my channel, and today I am going to be renovating the Roblox Adopt Me Starter House. So I was originally doing this video with my friend Leo. Um, he wasn't gonna renovate, but he was just gonna hang out and stick around. But unfortunately, when I was going back to edit the video, um, I didn't have my microphone on, and um, I just, I was so mad at myself for that. So, I'm really sorry about that. So, instead, I had to do my intro without Leo um, with that face. So, so sorry about that. But, without further ado, or... Yeah, you are going to be, while I'm editing the starter house, or I can't speak today. While I'm working on the starter house, you will possibly be seeing Leo pop in every once in a while, which is the Roblox character you'll see. That's just him checking things out, stuff like that. We are also in my private server, but let's get started. So the first thing I'm going to do is unequip my pet so it's not on the way. And I'm also going to start by deleting all of the stuff that first came with it. So I love how the stuff floats when it's like on top of the table and you delete the table, it floats. That's really funny. So I'm just going back and deleting all the stuff that came with it. Um, I noticed further out of the video, or further in through the video, I could have just kept some of the stuff I wanted to keep so I could have it for free, but you know, that's fine. So I decided to start off before the wallpaper with my first beginning decorations. There is Leo in front of the camera. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna stay silent from here. So one thing that bugs me about, um, that does bug me about Adopt Me is that I really love the game and all the stuff you have to build with, but a lot of the stuff you can't center, just like my welcome sign. It's kind of annoying, I couldn't really center it, but I just did the best that I could with it. Hello! Okay, so I'm back and 
There's Leo again with his T-Rex. Um, so right now I am just working on the bedroom. It was a little, what the, okay. Um, it was a little hard when I was done with the living room because then I was gonna do the kitchen. But then I realized that this is still a starter house, so it's still small. And I could have just redone the little entrance area so I could have room for the kitchen. But I had already gone pretty far. So I just decided to make a small kitchen right there. And yeah, and if you're wondering why I put the lemonade stand out, I was worried that I was gonna run out of money midway through. And so I asked Leo if he could donate a bit and so we did um but it turned out i was okay even if he didn't have donated but you know that's that Okay, so now it's time for me to change the floors and I just could not take that purple rug. It blinded my eyes and so I decided to change it to a nice gray rug. And now that I'm done with my bedroom, my tiny cute bedroom, I am moving on to the bathroom. Now, I would have added some pet stuff, but the house didn't have much room so later, after I finished recording this video, I went back and edit and added some, um, a pet bed and water bowl and food bowl because I felt really like dumb to not respect the pets. Um, so I just went to add that back later, and now I'm just adding the doors because midway through decorating the bathroom, I'm like. Oh my God, I need doors. And so I'm just adding those. I really like the, the, the doors I'm using right now. Well, yeah, I really like them because, I don't know, I like the color of them and I like the little windows. And I think it would be cool if Adopt Me had an update where you could choose your front door. I think that'd be super cool. But, yeah, that's what I did. So now we're just gonna be working on the bathroom.
Thank you guys so much for watching my Adopt Me Renovating the Starter House video. If you guys did enjoy, please be sure to leave a like. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you're new. And I will see you guys all in the next video. Peace out.